Hi friends, this is Nageshwar. Welcome to my channel, ITBot143. In this tutorial, I will show how to install and configure FTP server in Windows Server 2016. Come to Server, open Server Manager, and please select Add Roles and Features. Select Role Based Star, Feature Based Installation. Select Server from the Server Pool. And come to web server and here please select FTP server and also select FTP extensibility and after that click on next next and please choose this option restart the destination server automatically if required after that click on install After installation succeeded on server, close this, come to C drive, here we need to create a folder where FTP directory data will be copied. Here I want to copy few files. After this, right click on the folder, come to properties and come to security. Here, please select advanced and select disable inheritance and remove all inherited permission for this object. Apply. Yes. Okay. And after that, come to edit. Add. Here, please select Administrator. Okay. And I'm giving full control for Administrator. Apply. Okay. And after that, come to Tools. Open Internet Information Services Manager. Expand Server. And please select sites and right click on this select add FTP site and please choose the FTP site name and after that come to physical path and choose the folder that we have created in C drive next and in IP address please select your server IP and please remember this fort for further reference and after that please select start FTP site automatically and no SSL next and here please select basic and allow access to select specify users and here please type administrator and for permissions I'm giving read and write and after that click on finish now I want to create a user for that come to active directory users and computers After creating the user, again come to the folder and right click on this, come to properties, 
place select security and edit add here yeah, please select your user okay I'm giving basic permission apply okay after this come to Internet Explorer and type FTP 192.168. your server IP enter and please type username and password logon now we can access the file stored in FTP directory open this okay and after this I want to check with the other user that we have created enter username and logon here this user not able to access the FTP files to get access for this user come to IS manager and expand sites and please double click on FTP server and double click on FTP authorizing users and here please select add allo rule and please select specified users and here type the username and permissions I'm selecting read and write okay now come to Internet Explorer and type the password logon now we can access the files here this FTP site is limited to the domain users within the limited work premises to get access across the globe we have to do port forwarding and registry account in dynds.com come to router for port forwarding and in router please come to forwarding and please select virtual servers and click on add new and here it will ask for service port please enter the port number and internal port also same port number and IP address please enter your server IP and in protocol please select TCP and status enabled and in common service port please select FTP and after that save this and after port forwarding we have to register the account in dyndns.com like this we can install and configure FTP server in Windows Server 2016 I hope you like this video if you like this video please click on like button and please share this video with your friends and please visit my channel ITBird142 to watch more latest updated videos and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you friends. Have a nice day.